Well, we're going to take a peek at the uh, the wood stove situation this morning because it is a classic winter day out there. I'll start you off over here. The gentleman who had this cabin before me built a wood box right here built in the wall, nice eighth inch steel, and it goes all the way out. There's a matching door that opens into the garage where the firewood is stored. So I don't even have to go outside to fill the wood box and it <clears throat> keeps things neat and tidy. I've got a, a little splitting post here. I've got an old 1940s uh, can that's full of diesel that I use to start the fire if I ever lose the fire. I'm not suggesting you try that at home. This is a thrift store find and boy is it a sweetie forged fireplace shovel. Here's a uh, just a simple poker that came again with the cabin. Great for dragging the logs from the back to the front. Uh, the stove is an old energy harvester made in New Hampshire. Really nice basic cast iron box stove. Got a big lip on the front and like this on the inside we've got we've got a good fire going here so it's warm and toasty uh, got a cast iron pan of water on top a little trivet to put things down that need to be dried but not burned so that's the uh, that's the wood stove and while we're here I've got too many books and not enough bookshelves, so they're kind of like leaking all over the place. Hope you guys are warm and comfy today in a way that is carbon neutral.